Hello everyone, welcome to this video and it is the first video of a Telvin CSS crash course series. Um, I'm willing to create this crash course series uh, based on my comparison that I made in the previous video between the different uh, frameworks of CSS3. Uh, I'll include the link in the description. I compared Telvin CSS with Bootstrap, Bulma Foundation, a semantic UI, materialized CSS, uh, Skeleton, and other frameworks. And uh, we just came to know that Telvin CSS is among the best CSS frameworks. So, based on that idea, uh, I'm going to create this crash course on Telvin CSS 3. And it will be a, a, a well organized course and it will benefit you. So getting with the getting started with the Telvin CSS, you might have the concerns or wondering how to start or how to get started with Telvin CSS. And this course will help you to reach up there. So I assume that you already know CSS, HTML5, CSS3, and uh, like Bootstrap or any other framework of uh, CSS. So going to uh, starting the Telvin CSS introduction. What is Telvin CSS? Telvin CSS is a utility first framework and Telvin CSS is a highly customizable low level CSS framework. So we have another type of framework that is component based and the difference between the component based and utility first uh, frameworks are like that. In component based uh, components are pre-built and we use those components to create our website and our uh, almost all of our websites built with that component based framework will look alike uh, for example if if uh, you bring some websites built with the bootstrap you can guess that they are built with the bootstrap because they all have the same styles and uh, or if you bring uh, some websites and let's say we can guess that they are made with the semantic ui because they all have those uh, components which are in semantic ui but if you have a utility first CSS framework uh, which is built on uh, thousands of classes so you combine those classes and create a new design uh, you will not be able to guess whether that is made with uh, custom CSS or with the with a framework so Tailwind is more than a CSS framework it is an engine for creating custom designs that way Tailwind will uh, take care of almost everything and we will learn these things with this series so about the text border background colors about the font size font family or like with alignments of text padding margin even negative margin flex box positioning lists set index opacity screen reader visibility placeholder color first child last child and child or css create like transitions uh, which are somehow heavy in pure CSS, transform, spacing, divide, or focus ring, or text clamping. So we'll take care of this, all of this as well in this in our this series. And how to start with? It is just easy. You have uh, hundreds of pre-existing classes. You just use that all the classes inside your HTML, combine them. And that is all. You will use all those utility classes to build your custom design. Then. Uh, that it have many benefits like no more silly names for CSS classes and IDs. If you write pure CSS or a custom CSS, you have to think for the names of the CSS uh, classes and give into your elements. So here all the classes are pre-made, pre-built, so uh, you don't need to think of the names of the classes. And minimum lines of code in CSS five. When you have Telvin, you don't have to write uh, your own CSS. So that will be an ease for you and uh, your files, minimum lines will be included in your CSS file. And then Telvin CSS is highly customizable. You can create, for example, if you use Bootstrap, you have uh, uh, very specific types of buttons. But with Telvin, you can create hundreds of uh, buttons with different designs. So let's uh, watch this show and see what Telvin can do. This is taken from their own website and you can see that when they add the classes uh, on an HTML element, so the that uh, the changes occurs here.
you even don't have to leave your HTML when you create the components you just add the classes and the stars will be there for you so that's it and if you have more questions about Telvin CSS hit the subscribe button and bell icon and you will be notified for the next videos and if this video get about thousand view so uh, I will upload all the other videos so please share it with your friends and I don't mean to get views but I mean that this series should reach uh, as many people as it can so thank you very much